In the previous video, we created a channel geometry and assigned its surface triangles to different boundaries. This video will begin the case setup process in Converge Studio for this channel flow case. To set up a case in Converge Studio, you'll need to use the case setup doc. This doc contains parameters for the numerical schemes, physical models, and grid control that Converge needs for the simulation. The case setup doc is usually on the right side of the screen and may be hidden behind another doc. You may have to click the Case Setup tab in the bottom right corner of the screen to display the stock. If the Case Setup tab is not visible, you can display it by going to the View menu and checking the Case Setup Dock checkbox. If the Case Setup Dock is too small, you can drag it out from the other docks to detach it and then drag it back into the docks to resize it. In the Case Setup Dock, click Begin Case Setup to launch the Case Setup module. Here, you will select the relevant options for this channel flow case. Click Materials and select Gas Simulation, Global Transport Parameters, and Species, and uncheck Reaction Mechanism. Click Simulation Parameters and check Run Parameters, Simulation Time Parameters, and Numerical Parameters. Click Output and Post Processing and select Post Variable Selection and Output Files. Click Boundary Conditions and select Boundary. Click Initial Conditions and select Regions and Initialization. Because this is a simple channel flow simulation, we do not require any physical models, so click on the Physical Models section and uncheck Turbulence Modeling. Finally, click on Grid Control and choose Base Grid, Fixed Embedding, and Grid Scaling. Click Apply and the selected options will populate the Case Setup Dock. Click Done to close the Case Setup module. This section of the video will discuss case setup options relevant to the channel flow simulation from gas simulation until numerical parameters. The next video will describe the rest of the case setup process. Converge Studio preloads default values for many case setup parameters. Some of these parameters are appropriate for the channel flow simulation and some will need to be changed. In the case setup doc, click on gas simulation. Use the recommended defaults for gas simulation including the redlich kuang equation of state. Click on the Gas Thermodynamic Data button. Starting in version 2.2, this dialog box contains thermodynamic data for some species, including O2 and N2. Because the simulation only contains O2 and N2, you do not need to supply additional thermodynamic data. If you're using version 2.1 or older, you'll need to import a therm.dat file containing thermodynamic properties for the simulation by clicking on the Import Data From File button, selecting a therm.dat file, and clicking Import. Refer to the Converge Theory Manual for additional information on therm.dat files. Click OK to close this dialog box. Click on the Gas Transport Data button. Starting in version 2.2, this dialog box is preloaded with gas transport data. If you're using version 2.1 or older, You'll need to click on the Import Data from File button, select a gas.dat file, and click Import. In this example, the gas.dat file contains values specific for air. If your simulation were to involve a different gas, you'd need a gas.dat file with properties corresponding to that particular gas. Click OK to close the Gas Transport Data dialog box, and click OK again to close the Gas Simulation dialog box. Click on Global Transport Parameters. This dialog box allows you to change the Prandtl and Schmidt numbers. For a channel flow simulation, the default values are appropriate. Click OK. Click on Species. This dialog box allows you to define the participating species in the simulation. In the Gas tab, click the plus button twice. Next, click on one of the fields you just created and type O2. When you begin typing a species name, Converge Studio will display suggestions for species from the thermodynamic data. Now, click on the other field you created and type N2. Click OK to close this dialog box. Note that you can also define species using the Reaction Mechanisms dialog box by clicking on Materials in the Case Setup doc and checking the Reaction Mechanism option. This option requires a mech.dat input file. Because there are no reactions, we do not need the Reaction Mechanisms option for this case. Click on Run Parameters. 
Click on the solver drop down menu and select a pressure based steady solver. When you click OK, a dialog box will appear asking if you wish to load tolerance, relaxation, and piso defaults for a gas pressure based steady solver case. Click yes to automatically populate the numerical parameters with default values for a gas pressure based steady solver case. Click on simulation time parameters. In this dialog box, select a start time of zero and an end time of 20,000 cycles. The end time is case dependent and as we will see shortly, Converge may end a simulation before this end time if certain criteria are met. Next, type 1e-4, 1e-6, and 1 for the initial, minimum, and maximum time steps, respectively. The CFL criteria depend on the type of simulation. For this simulation, leave the CFL numbers as the default values. You can refer to the theory manual for additional information on CFL numbers. The last three fields in this dialog box apply only to spray or combustion modeling, so they will not be used in this simulation. Click OK to close this dialog box. Click on Numerical Parameters. The parameters in this dialog box are set to default values for a gas pressure-based steady solver case. In the Tolerances tab, set the cycles before convergence is checked to 7500. Converge will check if the specified tolerances have been reached after this many cycles and stop the simulation if they have. Because Converge will begin the simulation on a coarse grid, setting this value too low can lead to Converge prematurely stopping the simulation and reaching a false solution. Click OK to close this dialog box. The next video in this series will finish describing the case setup process in Converge Studio.